my team turn. Take me out on the water. We fishing. Way out in the woods. Where the breathing is easy, the living is good. Out in the grave. And welcome to Leary Smith Outdoors. We're sponsored by the Badger Sportsman Magazine, Bartline Barrels, Warrior Boats, Big Snow Resort, Lynch and McGuanago, Wings Over Wisconsin, Mike's Country Meats, Midwest Shooter Supplies, Burger Smokehouse, Delco, Vexlar, Dick Smith's Bait and Tackle, Come Along Measuring Tools, Commit Law Firm, Norm Zag, and Jiffy. And remember, it's a great day to be alive. Holy moly. Morning and welcome to Larry Smith Outdoors. Hey, guess what? Today we're up at Lake of the Woods and we're up here for a, a warrior event that's going on tomorrow and we're out free fishing. And I'll tell you what, Chuck, you know what? You're saying this is a big fish. What we're doing actually is we're, we're trolling some contour here and we've got lead core out and we're running a little bit of wire with an eight ounce uh, snap weight on there. And Chuck's got a pretty decent fish he's saying on here. Well, he puts the brakes on and he doesn't go anywhere. Is there anywhere. big fish in this system? A couple. Right. <laughs> well, we'll see. When it comes to fisheries, Lake of the Woods is probably one of the top five walleye fisheries in the country. I got a chance to fish this last year, open water, when I was up here for the Warrior event. And then this, uh, you're back here, so this is definitely uh, one of my top five lakes to fish for sure. Yep. Last year we got in this same area a 32 incher. Holy cats, look how deep he is. Yeah, look at how are. thick he is. We came out here for a couple hours before uh, the second annual Warrior Boats David A. Anderson Memorial Walleye Shootout tomorrow. Um, Warrior Boats lost a great member last year. It was my father. Uh, looked up to him. I mean, he was my best friend. So we last year we were going to do a owner's tournament. And right before the owner's tournament, we had his passing. So it got quickly switched to the memorial tournament. The one thing about this tournament, it's not only just a tournament. Uh, a lot of tournaments everybody looks at and wants to beat everybody. Everybody comes up here has a good time. I mean, as much as we stress it, when you buy a warrior boat, you're joining a family, and it's more of a family reunion. We have a great following. We try to exceed at customer service, and it's just a great event. It's gonna be wild to see what shakes out tomorrow. Sounds like if the forecast holds true, it's gonna be calm. Last year, we had 20 mile an hour winds and four to five footers out here, which was perfect warrior weather. Well, it's gonna be a big change tomorrow, and. I tell you what, the fish on Lake Woods are snapping. We fished for a couple hours today. We had a 24 and a half and a 26, and it's gonna be awesome. So stay tuned. This is gonna be a good show. Creating a fishing boat that delivers unsurpassed fishability, speed, and performance on the water is achieved through an ongoing commitment to quality and a driving passion for making great boats even better. You'll see this commitment to quality and a passion for building the fisherman's boat in every Warrior Boat model you see on the water. For additional information on Warrior Boat's new V208, check out their website at warriorboatsinc.com. 
or visit your local Warrior Boats dealer to schedule a test drive and see for yourself why no fishing boat on the market offers a smoother, drier ride, more interior cockpit space, more storage, more room to fish big water in complete comfort and safety than the V208 from Warrior Boats. Dalco, far and away the nation's leading boat cover manufacturer, precisely fit for a large variety of OEM makes and models. Dalco premium covers are the boating equivalent of a hand-tailored suit. Not only are Dalco covers the best fitting and best quality, they include unique features like our polis cover lift system and ratchet attachment system, making them the easiest and fastest covers to install and remove. Visit DalcoMarine.com for more information on how to order. Use promo code LARRY10 to receive a 10% discount today. Burger Smokehouse, your handcrafted smoked meat headquarters since 1952. Our dry rub recipes, aging process, and natural hardwood smoking come together to create bold, satisfying flavors that we are proud to stand behind. Whether it's summer sausage, hearty sportsman's cut bacon, or dry rub barbecue ribs, we are your source for top-notch hardwood smoked meats that you'll be proud to serve family and friends. Visit us online at smokehouse.com or look us up at your local grocery store. Good morning and welcome to Larry Smith Outdoors. I'll tell you what, we're on beautiful Lake of the Woods this morning and we're here for a very special event. We've got the whole Warrior family behind us and I'll tell you what, Chuck and Kent, I'll tell you, we are here for what reason? We're here for the second annual David Anderson Memorial Walleye Tournament. And I'll tell you, it's going to be a good day out there. I'll... It's going to be a great day. It's always a great day to go fishing. It definitely is. You know. This is a very special fishery here. It's a very special event that we have going on, and we've got a perfect day out here. What are you guys expecting to happen? I expect a lot of big fish caught. I expect probably 40 to 45 pounds. To win it? To win it. Holy cats, there are some big fish. And on this system here, there is a slot here. There is. It's 19 and a half to 28 is protected, but with the aim format that we're doing, every fish is in play. That's the cool part about that format that I Absolutely. love. Absolutely. You know, as one of the owners of Warrior, why don't you tell us a little bit real quick about, about Warrior Boats? Well, Warrior Boats was picked up back in 2010. As you know, Kent's dad, Dave, and I were the two drivers to grab it. And after a lot of negotiations and stuff, it took about a year, year and a half to get going. We started slow just a couple of boats first year and we've been on a continual roll since then. Every year it's been picking up more and more. We've had a, this last year's been a tremendous year for us. We're happy as can be to, with our sales and the job that everybody is doing at the factory. And everybody knows Dave has passed away on us, so there's just three of us. Uh, Pat Brookshaw, Al Linen, and myself are the owners. And with our determination to make the company go forward, I think we're doing a pretty good job myself. Well, I'll tell you what, you're 100% right about that. And as far as a boat, uh, that's I've never had a boat that's been so good to me. I mean, I love that boat and I'm hoping that we can stay with you guys as long as you'll put up with me, well, both of you guys. The way you drive a boat, it's gotta be good to stand up. You got something to that. Hey, stay tuned. Let's see what happens today up here at Lake of the Woods. We just made our first stop of the morning. Team number 27, Brett King, Destry Foyt. It is 7.55, no fish on the card yet. We're gonna hang out with these guys for a little bit and see what they're doing. It's a good and bad day, I guess. With that being said, you know, Dave was a huge loss to the Warrior community and a good friend of mine. Uh, and last year, I actually got to film this event with you guys and uh, we got to watch what I said was Dave flying over at him just about all day, putting fish on his line. It was unbelievable to see. But uh, this year, Destry and I decided we wanted to fish this event, so we're out here. It's been a little slow so far, but we'll stay after him. It'll happen eventually. I think there's about 45 boats, all Warriors fishing this tournament, so. Uh, it's a nice benefit uh, as to being a Warrior owner to get to fish a tournament against all the other Warrior owners. So, fun tournament. We fished it last year. The bite was a little bit tougher last year. 
but uh, still some good fish caught and hopefully this year we uh, see some bigger bags than what we saw last year. All right, we just pulled up on team number 45, Mike and Randy. They got a fish on right now. We're gonna see what they got. It's a pretty busy area and we're seeing lots of fish being boated. We're just, we're just running lead core. Uh, South Dakota fishing. Pulling cranks. Seems to be working well for us. Got a few a few decent fish on the scorecard so far and seems to be working out. Uh, so far we've got a 27 inch, a 26 inch, a 23 and a half inch and several fish between 17 and 19 inches. We're pulling sevens and nines for size of bait going about 2 to 2.5 miles an hour and you just find them in the fish are spotty. So you kind of hit them in groups and, and then it calms down. Oh boy. Big one? Yeah, it's big and he tried to he throw tried the hook. To reach. That's not good. Okay, get up there. It's a pitch. northern. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. It's a pike. Oh, it is. Yeah. We're going to have to get her. Why. Darn it. I wondered why he surfaced like that. Yep. Not you can have that one. one. Not. Wrong color. <laughs> They've got a towel here for you, Bob, too. We got about four more hours to catch two more good fish. Badger Sportsman Magazine is the longest running outdoor magazine in the state of Wisconsin. Badger Sportsman provides you with the best information from local Wisconsin guides and professionals so you can be successful in the outdoors. Whether you're in a boat or a tree stand, Badger Sportsman Magazine is the new go-to for information on duck hunting, deer hunting, hard and soft water fishing, and more. Enjoy our product reviews, quick tips, and all of our articles on our website today. I'm Mark Green. I'm Patrick Lynch. Welcome to our all new Lynch McQuanago dealership. The brand new Lynch McQuanago dealerships have over 500 new Chevys, Chryslers, Dodges, Jeeps, Rams, and pre owned vehicles in stock and all priced to sell. Stop by and check out their massive selection of trucks and SUVs, perfect for all your fall outdoor sports. You do the driving, we'll do the listening, because I want you to love how you feel in your new ride. Nobody sells for less than Lynch. Wings Over Wisconsin, a nonprofit organization dedicated to natural resource restoration, preservation, and education with youth and community involvement. Through cooperation with private landowners, state and federal agencies, Wings Over Wisconsin has been a leader in the preservation of our natural wildlife habitat with donated dollars staying in Wisconsin for Wisconsin. For information about how you can join this great organization or how to start a new chapter, please visit wingsoverwisconsin.org. Just making our third stop of the morning. Justin and Mariah Schneider, they got five on the card. They got a 26 and a 28. Sounds like the rest are 22s. They might have one other one that was bigger. So the big fish are biting. It's gonna shake out to be an interesting day. We're up here at the Warriors Shootout, having a great day. One thing I love about the Warrior Shootout is it reminds me of why I own a Warrior boat. Not only are they quality, but it really is a family. Uh, just spending three days with all these great people. It's my wife, Mariah. It's just awesome to get out, out here and catch all these nice fish and spend time with great people. And this tournament's the David Anderson Memorial. 
and I don't think Dave would be more proud than today to see all these warriors out here pulling lead core. It's what he loved to do. If you own a warrior, you seriously need to come to this thing next year because this is it's one a of, lot of fun. It's one of our favorite weekends of the whole year. And if you got a, a wife that likes to fish or a couple buddies, just get up here. It's just a blast. You crush fish. It's all good people. It's just a great time. That's an upgrade. That one you don't have to crank quite as hard. That's a good one. Going. There he is. Oh, there. Oh. Yeah, honey. Oh my god. Yay. Oh my god. Awesome, honey. Open your bill. Let's get him in the My boat. arms are like jello. Hey. Give me some. Oh. Woo. <laughs> Good job, hon. <sighs> there is my half crane. Right, <laughs> you brought your knife on. Okay. Oh. Camera high fives are okay. Okay, good. <laughs> So you think, honey, Lake of the Woods, baby? I think it was really hard to reel in. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Get her back. She's tired. Oh, no, she ain't that tired. <laughs> I'm trying to crank. Keep cranking. Keep, I'm keep trying. It coming. Nice and smooth, though. If he's willing to come up, bring him up. Don't play with him. Commit when you bring them up. There he is. Yes! Oh my god. Get him in the boat. Get him in the boat. Yes! Nice job, honey. Lake of the Woods, baby. You've caught like. Upgrade. Five over 25 inches now. You're. It's been awesome. I love it. <laughs> All right, right back. Good job. Oh man. Nice short climber. Take care of this monster. You want to do it on the floor there? There you go. 29's getting better all the time. What does the Warrior family mean to me? Um, it is, it is an extended family. It, uh, a lot of these people, you, you know, you see maybe once a year, tournaments here, maybe there. Some of them, this is the only time you ever get to see them. And uh, it's nice, a guy comes up here, gets to talk to them, hang out, you know, everybody's full of BS, like every fisherman I ever met. So you don't know whether to believe it, if they're catching fish or not, but the, uh, it's fun, it's, it's just a good time. Um, I wish there was. I wish everybody with a warrior would come up here and go fishing, and, and if they if they would like get into the tournament on the weekend, you know, and can't have too many boats. You know, the more people, the more fun. Variety is uh, spice of life, right? So get everybody we can up here and and have fun. It's just a good time. I mean, as you can see today, it's dead flat. It is beautiful out. Um, the bite's pretty good. You know, we're having. I hope a good day. We'll find out at the end of the day how it all. How it all goes, but uh, it's been fun. The tournament means a lot. The can't me, <laughs> and I know Dad would appreciate it. We miss him every day, but you know, wish he was here. But this is a remembrance of him anyway. So I hope everybody has fun. And like I said, I hope everybody can get up here. If you have a warrior, come and fish. It's a good time. There's some big baskets out here. I mean, Adam Anderson, last year's champion, has got a heck of a bag. Um, Justin Schneider, we were with him, he had a good bag, but I tell you what, 
it's anyone's game. There's so many big fish out here, it's unreal. We're gonna leave this pack of boats, we're gonna head north and see what else we can find. For over 25 years, Midwestern Shooter Supply has been your premier dealer for hunting supplies. Our staff is friendly, experienced, and certified with over 15 years in gunsmithing experience. We're your one-stop shop for your hunting needs. Our inventory is at the lowest possible price, and we will match any other dealer advertised price. Do you do more than hunt? Check out our supply of fishing products as well. Visit Midwestern Shooter Supply today, or shop our web store at mwshooters.com. Midwestern Shooter Supply, we want to be your outdoor supplier. Introducing the next generation of Sonar. Sonar Foam by Vexlar, the world's first smart device sonar. Download the free app. Try the demo feature and see why Sonar Foam will rival the performance of Sonar systems costing hundreds more. The Sonar Phone does not require cell phone coverage. You create your own Wi-Fi hotspot and can share with your friends. Download the free app today. And for a limited time, with any purchase of a Sonar Phone, you get a free smartphone armband. That's the Sonar Phone by Vexlar. Hey, I'll tell you what, welcome back to Larry Smith Outdoors. It's about noon, Chuck, and I'll tell you what, I, the wind laid right down to nothing, and I thought the bite was gonna slow down. But we just came across a, two of our team members, and they had a double on, and yep. some dandy fish, huh? 26 and a half and a 26 and three quarter. Yeah, I mean, you, when it comes oh. to catching walleyes, them are definitely the ones for, you want. Yes, they're a considerable upgrade for them. You know, on, with this, format that they're fishing, they can weigh in seven fish, right? They can weigh in, yes. They can catch as many, many as they want and put them on the card. They take their best five. Okay, their best five, five. fish, okay. Yes. And take the total weight off of that. Yes. Yep. Okay. You know, it seems to be that, I mean, we've covered a lot of miles today out here on the lake and everybody's pretty much spread out. Now, we just came into a group of boats here. This is about the most boats we've seen in an interesting thing. We ran across a couple of the, the, the guys that I thought would be in the top for sure. And two of the boats didn't have very many walleyes at all so far. And they were about halfway through the, the day here. It's noon. But one of them had some giants. Yes. Had, what do you yes. say? He had a couple 29 inches? Yes. A couple 29s and uh, 27. He figures he has about 40 pounds. Yeah, that's interesting. You know, and he was one of the first boats that we checked on. And we went and checked on the other two, and we thought for sure they would have, you know, some big fish in there, but that wasn't the case. No. But that's the interesting part about fishing in general, but tournament fishing for sure. Today is good. Tomorrow could be better. Tomorrow could be worse. Right. And maybe in an hour from now, them other guys, yep. they might have some of them bigger fish. But, you know, when you come up here and you look at Lake of the Woods and the amount of fish, it seems to be one of them kind of lakes that every place we stop, we're marking walleyes. And look at the big schools. There's You're just one, not one or two. They're all over. You right. might run a run a couple hundred yards and run a uh, have a big school of fish. Then you're out of them. Then you'll find another one. I tell you what. I wish Winnebago was like this. A lot of people <laughs> wish a lot of lakes were like this. Hey, stay tuned. Let's see what happens the rest of the day here on Lake of the Woods. Get some Anderson luck here. I figure he couldn't be here. His rod might as well be fishing. <laughs> but they're nice, fat fish. They're fun to catch. Well, 
we go. There we go. Right there, buddy. See what we got this time. Can it stay on and can it be decent? And see if we can get lucky. Bring him up here high now. Get him up high for me. Yeah, Let's put that rod down. Lake of the Woods, Walleye. Okay, let's do her, buddy. It definitely looks like it's gonna be a tight race. What do you think today makes the difference? You think it's a color, speed? Because we saw some guys moving pretty fast with their lead core. Right. And they seem to have the bigger bags. It did, for sure. You know, and that's an interesting thing that you just brought up when we were out there. You know, a couple of the groups, there was, you know, anywhere from seven to 10 boats in there, and we checked on everybody, and out of each group, two or three guys had big bags that we saw. And I'll tell you, it seemed to me that it was the speed. I think speed. No doubt. And maybe a little bit of the color, too. We noticed what they're running for crankbaits, a lot of them. But I think uh, speed has a big, big Speed's deal today. Speed is definitely going to be a factor here. So hey, stay tuned. Let's uh, put the Warrior on the trailer and go up to the weigh-in and see how this thing finishes out. Mike Olson and Ross Swenson. This is your second annual Warrior Boats Memorial Walleye Shootout Champions. Congratulations. We were right about the speed. That was the key on the winning weight on this tournament. Yep, the, the speed was it. That definitely was it. We kind of suspected that out there. Yep, because the guys that were trolling faster were definitely the guys catching yep. more fish and bigger fish for definitely. sure. So it's amazing how little different things make such a big difference when it comes to fishing. Pay attention to little things and it seems to help. Hey, that pretty much wraps up our trip up here to Lake of the Woods. And just remember, like I always say, what a great day to be alive. Thank you, Chuck. Thank you, Larry. It's Appreciate been a pleasure. It. Thanks. Did, did, you, did you beat the hell out of Dan on the way out here? No, I don't think so. He said it was a fun ride. Yeah. Was, is Beth with you? Oh, oh, okay, yeah, okay. Beth knew better. Let's go. Four up. You're gonna build a bench press by the end of this weekend. <laughs> Just what I like. <laughs> I got these, they're not Mike's Country Meats. Come on, Larry, really? Filming for you? No snacks? You're saying we're filming for Larry and we gotta eat the off brands? We gotta eat some off brands. Come on, what's up? I agree. Maybe we'll have some tomorrow. Maybe. <laughs>